You know, actually, speaking of bleeding Russia as a goal, we should show this clip that was uh, released by the Ukrainian government of Lindsey Graham talking with Vladimir Zelensky. Uh, it was edited, but it was edited by the Ukrainian government. So let's take a look at this clip. Free or die. Free or die. Now you are free. Yes. And we will be. And the Russians are dying. It's the best money we've ever spent. Thank you so much. No, it's... So this video is edited so that, and in fact, if you see the video on Twitter, they have, you know, community notes to indicate that it was edited. He didn't say consecutively, uh, Russians are dying. It's the best money we ever spent. But Ukraine thought it'd be a good idea to edit it. So it did say that. Yeah. Ukraine put out the deceptive edit. And right. regardless, in the same sitting, Lindsey Graham is bragging that the Russians are dying. Right. And he's saying that this is the best money we've ever spent. So right. Ukraine Which does give away the game a bit. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So Ukraine, you know, just truncated the message and, you know, put it into its into its, uh, you know, core idea, which is that right. the U.S. is spending money to kill Russians and using Ukraine for it. Right. So, yeah, they just made it concise. They saved us all a lot of time. But I appreciate it. I appreciate Lindsey Graham's candor because you, you have Democrats like Jamie Raskin, uh, you know, a congressional progressive saying that we need to arm Ukraine because Ukraine's at the center of the struggle for democracy and Russia is the beacon of anti-LGBTQ hatred. So somehow arming Ukraine is in support of trans rights. That's literally what Jamie Raskin argues. Lindsey Graham is more honest. He says, no, we're arming Ukraine so that we can kill Russians. And I appreciate his honesty much yeah. more than that of progressives who pretend that this is about something else.